George, George Teddy Bear, appointment for Dr. Brown. Hello, my name is Dr. Derek Brown. I'm a pediatrician, a kids and teddy bear doctor by trade, and I'm here to do a physical exam on the teddy bear in front of us who is super cute. Um, we will do a physical exam from head to palm, making sure that the teddy bear is doing okay. This teddy bear in particular, his name is George, and we're here to make sure that George is healthy and doing well. Um, I have what I have in front of me, including a mask um, to protect me, along with my stethoscope and a badge to identify that I am a doctor. So let's go and work together to make sure that George is healthy. So first, what we're gonna do is get our height and weight. And with that, from the teddy bear kit, we have our own growth chart to measure height. So first thing we're gonna do is take George. George is super cute again. And we're gonna measure George from paw up to ear. And you can see here roughly that we're about 19 and a half inches, which is a good size for a bear. And then what we're going to do also is we're also going to measure our weight and we, what we have is our scale and we're going to put George on that scale and, and quite clearly for me I can see that we weigh about 18 pounds which is a normal healthy weight for a teddy bear. Classically um, with that height and weight measurements I can see that George has been eating well, eating all his vegetables and fruits as well as exercising regularly daily, at least four or five days a week, keeping our heart rate above 120. So with all this in mind, I think that we are super healthy, strong and fit, perfect for a bear George's age. Today we're gonna to take a look at George. We're gonna do a physical exam from head to paw and we're gonna make sure that George is healthy. So the first thing we're gonna do is take our stethoscope which we use to listen to the heart and lungs. And we're first gonna identify and make sure that the heart is beating well and that everything is normal. So I'm gonna listen here. And we're listening to make sure that the heart is sounding perfect, which in terms of George, George's heart is beating wonderfully, has a beautiful heart. And then we're gonna, we're gonna take a listen to the lungs and make sure the lungs sound normal and healthy. So I'm listening here making sure that George's lungs sound great, which they do, they sound very clear. No decreased lung sounds, so I'm very happy here. And I think we're doing awesome. So now, so now we're gonna focus on, on the eyes specifically. We have our pen light, you have your own in your teddy bear kit. And we're gonna press down, make sure that the eyes look wonderful. And yes, they do, the honey bear eyes look Awesome. And also we're gonna take a quick look at the ears by pushing them back like this. And from what I see, we have wonderfully beautiful ears. And they look relatively clean, which I'm super happy about. Less wax for the ears, and I'm super happy that the bear's mother is doing great with that. Now, along with it, I look at overall presentation, um, and I see that the skin looks wonderful. The fur hair looks very well kept, very bright, vibrant, and clean. I'm now going to put this away, and you should put yours away as well. And we're gonna now take a look, um, lying down to make sure that the tummy is doing well. So we're gonna actually lie down like this, teddy bear and all. And, I, and just overall presentation, the ribbon looks perfectly well kept. I'm very happy with that. And we're gonna now push down on the stomach I'm gonna just tilt here, just making sure the stomach feels nice and soft. And I feel that it's super squishy, which it should be. I like how it feels. I don't feel anything unusual, or n I don't feel that there's anything of concern for me. And also I'm gonna check the arms and make sure that the arms and paws are working in perfect order. And from what, from what I see right now, they do. Paws and all, okay. I am also gonna take a quick look at the legs and we can see how they extend and flex. And the actual legs look like they're working just right and perfect for me and for you. We're now gonna lift up the bear. We're gonna take a quick look at the back 
Make sure that the spine looks fine along the back and everything looks great, tail and all. I think we're doing wonderful. So that is our physical exam for, the, for George and I think we're doing wonderful. Um, vaccines are important because they protect us from disease and allow us to be healthy and strong. What we have here is all that we need to provide George with a vaccine, including the vaccine itself, a band-aid for boo-boos, and also um, to complete the shot process, as well as a sticker that says all heart. So classically, what we usually use is this vaccine. This, is, this does not have a needle here for your, for your child's protection. But what we do is we would fill it up with the vaccine, and then what we would do is either um, provi um, provide that vaccine in, either in the shoulder, um, along the upper part of the arm rather, and along the leg where there's a lot of muscle mass. And we would inject it like that. As you can see, George did not cry. George did great through the whole process and was happy and did it with all, all of it, it was done with a smile. For the boo-boo, we provide a band-aid, as you can see here, to make sure that everything is healthy and complete. And along with that, we have a sticker that says, all heart, and we place it here where the heart is always present, or in this case, on the paw. So that is all that we have today for vaccines. Hi, George. Welcome to radiology. We hear you hurt your arm on, a, on your tricycle. We're going to take a quick x-ray to make it so the doctors can know what's wrong. We're going to put a shield on you and we're going to put your arm right out here on this board. Going to move my machine around a little bit. The light comes on and I'm going to go back and you're going to hold real still. We're going to take a quick picture and we'll be all done. Hi George, my name is Stacy. It looks like you did not fracture, it's just a sprain. I'm gonna introduce you to our trainers, Tate and Sierra. Hey George, so we're just gonna wrap your arm real quick. Uh, it's gonna help add a little bit more uh, stability. Thank you.